Good afternoon. Hello. Oh, good afternoon. My name is Roger Lee Foreman and I work for a local multinational operations systems management company. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm not interested. I, I just need a few minutes of your time to discuss in detail the upcoming refurbishments due on your house. Upcoming? Oh, it's a lovely day, isn't it? <laughs> I do like what you've done with your garden. <laughs> what on earth are you talking about? I don't understand. Which bit? Which? Which bit of what I said don't you understand? Well, all of it. You said upcoming, but I haven't made any arrangements to do any well, work on my... Well, it's on my clipboard. You've got extensive refurbishments due on your property. All right, calm down. Well, you've simply forgotten. Look, I'm sure it's just been a misunderstanding. Are you suggesting I'm bad at my job? No, 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 not at all. I'm sure you're normally very capable. Perhaps you've got the wrong house. <laughs> wrong house? Wrong house? You seriously think I've got the wrong house? What number is this? 23. 23? I've got 32. Whoops! <laughs> How silly of me. <laughs> See ya. Thank you for your time. <laughs> like you have any idea. You're not a professional like me. I'm an artiste! If you want to talk about professionalism, how about we don't drop the 30 pound mic, huh? And, and stop blaming Brian. And don't you dare blame me for what is an act which has clearly run its course. What are you talking about? I bring the king back for people who appreciate real music. Real music, that's what I do, Sharon. I'm the real deal. You're a dried up 50-year-old man, Jules. It's time you start realising you're not the king of rock and roll. You need to find yourself a real job and stop clowning around on my stage, on my time. How dare you? I'm the only reason this place makes any money. Your shithole is full of philanderers of bloody whores. They only drink in it because there's nowhere better for them to go. Well, what should I? Drive? What are you talking about? When we're dropping off in town, when we get rid of him. <laughs> no, George. No, I mean, he's got to go. But we're not letting him go. You understand? Yeah. Right. Which one of us is going to do it then? Let's flip for it. Now look, it's all right, I don't mind driving. <laughs> no, 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 there's no driving, George. I mean, one of us has got to do the deed. And the other one has to move the body. You're over the hill, yeah. but that don't mean you're dead. Yeah. So fight for your right to stay alive instead. I don't know what you've been told. There ain't no fun in getting old. So march your ass out of that door. Down to Crowley's surplus.